Hello everyone, it's the Upform team over here, and today we're just going to run through the process of how to access your Google Form responses from an iOS device, specifically an iPhone in this case. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do is to make sure you have all the necessary apps already downloaded to your phone. So in this case, we want the app called Google Drive. As you can see, the bottom left of the screen is called Google Drive already on your phone. Now. Once you have your apps already downloaded, it's just a matter of accessing them. So let's just enter the Google Drive app quickly. As you can see, if you were to scroll around this app, all the files that are currently saved to your drive will appear here, including not just Google Forms, but Sheets, Word documents, PowerPoint presentations, etc. In our case, however, we're trying to access Google Forms. So let's select the appropriate Google Form you want to first open. So in this case, I will be opening Event Registration 2. Now, once I've selected it, as you can see, there are options of how you can open them. So for our case, we are going to open it using the default browser app, which is the last option on this list. Simply hit that button, and as you can see, you will be brought to a different page or a new tab where your Google form will then open. And because we're using the default browser option, the preview of your Google form should look almost exactly the same as you would see it with a computer. So now that we have the Google form open, trying to access the responses is a pretty similar process. So as you can see in the upper menu, there is an option called questions, responses, and settings. Obviously, we want to check out responses, so let's select that. And once you've selected it, as you can see, all the responses will be summarized for you down here. You can also access responses through questions, per question, or per individual form that was answered. And that should be it. Hopefully, this helps you better manage your Google Forms and any data collection you might be doing. Be sure to like and subscribe, and if you need any more help with managing your Google Forms, check out the rest of our channel, either using the link on the upper right corner of this video or the links down below. See you next time!